Meet Ethical Crack. My ultimate Iron Man is taking the game mode just a step further. Not only can I not use a bank, but I can't use any method of storage outside of my inventory. That means no looting bag, no death storage, no death piles, no stash units, and no player-owned house storage. To achieve my goals in this game mode, I will need to think and play very differently. Hello friends and foes, it is good to have you back. In the last episode of Ethical Crack, we finished all our wilderness activities, so we are now safe and ready to continue on to our next goal, which is get the quest cape. My first sub milestone of quest cape is to get all the quests that require Entrama completed, and the ones I have left for that are Devious Mines, Recipe for Disaster, the uh, White Knight Friend, and Monkey Madness 2. So for that, I'm going to need three stat requirements, 65 smithing, 70 cooking, and 69 slayer. Plus, I have another goal in this video, where I will be getting the first item on this account that I will be keeping forever, finally. We are starting off just joining Ethical Crack, using up the last of the supplies I picked up from Artio. Alright, we got a whole bunch of rubies, and we're going to turn them into this friend. Uh, could I get a medallion? Yeah. Uh, six. I need one more. Really? I need one more. <laughs> yeah, alright. All right. Well, hey, let's go get another ruby, eh? <laughs> one thing that can be really helpful when playing a UAM is knowing that this friend over here, that one, uh, sells rubies. If we come into his shop, we can buy a cut ruby. One gold leaf. Oh, that was cheaper than I expected. I thought those were 300k. And there it is, there's our medallion. Let's go check this up in our house. This thing requires 82, so, uh, nothing like a nice cup of tea. And, wait, wait, what? Oh, shit. Um, all right, crystal saw will fix it. Wob, 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 wob. And, and there it is. Yeah, we got out there. Okay, now we can go make it. Uh, hi, editing crack here. I don't know why this clip started late, but look, there yeah, we put it up. We're just chilling, cooking some fish from Frankie's shop over there. And what do you know, 60 cooking? 62 cooking. That is the requirement for uh, some fake fish. So we can do swan song. I am trying my darndest to get an earth talisman. And we have killed 74 earth wizards without getting one. That's insane, it's a 1 in 20. Haha, <laughs> that's it. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really happy that this happened. You ready, 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 ready? Wait, hold on. Oh no, I gotta put that in front. Oh. There, sorry, not used to moving this. 100 Earth Wizards without getting an Earth Talisman. It's a 1 in 20. That's amazing. Okay, imagine you like flip a coin, right? And then you flip a coin again and it lands on the same side. So you're like, huh, that was interesting. So you flip it again and it lands on the same side. And you flip it again and it lands on the same side. And you flip it again and it lands on the same side. So you flip it again and it lands on the same side. And you flip it again and it lands on the same side. So you know what? You flip it one more time and it lands on the same side. This is rarer than that. Like, not getting an Earth Talisman is 101 is rarer than flipping a coin on the same side eight times in a row. Oh my god, it exists. 105. Oh, look at that camera work. Oh my god, Steven Spielberg shit right here. Oh, the screen shake. Oh, oh this is a masterpiece. Man's got hands. Oh, look at that footwork. Oh, look how well that boss is framed. Holy. Do I need more food? Is shooting it just not going to be enough? Ugh. Ah, now we're good. We're good. Sick. Fishing level. 
And now we can do one of my preferred AFKs for fishing and cooking training in this sort of mid-game. Uh, monkfish. We sit here, we can be really AFK, and when we cook them we get decent XP. Rates are not too bad here. So I'm going to AFK this for a while as we push up towards 70 cooking. And when I feel like actually doing stuff we'll go hit up some more Slayer. Got a nice chill level here at Monkfish and that's halfway to the 70, but we're going to go mix up the method for the next one with what I believe to be the fastest. We needed a quest, so here it is. This next segment is just an absolute nightmare. I'm trying to show you like the most efficient UIM skilling I can and, and it goes like this. I'll leave it all in, so uh, yeah, this is what my gameplay is like by the way. Yeah, we just like buy two worlds of Karambons, that be one, and that one be two. And then this friend shows up. Oh hey! Uh, what tile can I light a fire on? Wait, can I not light a fire on? Oh, I can light it there, 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 okay, okay, we're good, we're good. And then I can cook all my things. And this gives me mean as XP rates. I will reset all and I'll update you on it soon. Oh, oh my god, I'm making the wrong ones. Hold, hold. Wait, didn't he just like teach me? Oh no, I gotta talk to the other friend. Oh man, I've instantly messed it up. Okay, but like pretend all that stuff works really well. And now I can like cook this for real, right? Oh my god, no. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no, don't space bar. I'm doing it. Okay, now we reset the XP. 136k an hour. This method pumps. <laughs> I just fished up a hard clue and it's there like it, oh it's right next to me okay okay does this person sell a spade I really hope they sell a spade that would be sick ah uh, they do not okay cool that one's done for a wonderful amount of herbal or XP and can we do the next step we can show me some good elks to pay for more current one cooking yep Oh, this is going to be the first time. This is the first farm run we're doing after acquiring the RD Cloak and the Explorer's Ring number twos. So, we've got the farm tally to be actually useful. Did I need to pick white berries? No, I did not. We have come to that time where we get to replace one of these, oh, just amazing trees. 70 farming. That is a diary requirement for a poison ivy bush, so once I manage to get a poison ivy seed, we will be making use of that. Big level from Slayer. All those beautiful drops of mithril armor from Bloodvalds have us a smithing level coming in. Cheers, Kovac. Much appreciated. 65. That's a super important level, because I just love Shazian Gloves 3. Wait, are those still a thing? I thought that was all, like, deleted with the favor being removed oh my god we got 1752 uh i mean 1750 as well not 1752 does that is that just new yeah that means new worlds are unlocked which is awesome but that's not the reason either holy that was a combo breaker uh devious minds requires 65 smithing and that's one of our three entrana quests so we've got that done damn that was good thank you blood valves. Oh, this has been updated. You could actually do Scurrius on a task now. Let's go do that. We're just Turiel boosting till we get to 100 tasks, so soon we'll stop doing that. I just want to get that shitload of points from Konar, seeing as I was already at like 90 uh, champion scroll roulette. I've done two. That's cheating. I have a feeling this unnoted pot is going to be a waste because I just remembered that the little baby rats are going to count too, and this task is going to go down and like... Six kills? Five, six kills? Oh, I got a Slayer level from that. Did not realize that was going to happen. Um, oops, 67 Slayer. Two Scarius KC, two. Palm them. Well, this was significantly more... Oh, I didn't get that before, apparently. Oops. This was significantly more fun than most tutorial tasks. This is a cool update. Oh, look, the monkey corpse is in the tree. <laughs> Oh, a spidey task. We could do Seragnus too. Ah, a little bit of cheeky bossing during this. Oh, I don't have a melee setup. Never mind, might just do temple spiders. Welcome to my 99 party. That is 99 slayer tasks. Yeah, boring task, but it'll do. Is that it? Oh, 100. To oh, that's so many points. Not a bad start. We'll go with that. Steel dragons can go on the block list. 
There's no way I'm ever doing this task. Nice, another one blocked. Give me black demon so I can block those two. Ooh. Oh shit, I might want to block those until I have 83 Slayer. Because at the moment I can only do the shitty ones. Yep, those can go on the block list for now. Block task. Oh, that feels good using those Slayer points we got. What else we got? Fire Giants. They're kind of bad. They're kind of really bad. Do you know what? Fuck it, let's just block everything straight up. We'll get we'll get more quest points soon. We can black demons can go later. Nice! So this is kinda slow, but I don't mind. But every time we get a wyvern's task, we have to come here, search the bookcase, blow up a rock friend, mine for coal, because I forgot to mine for coal. Then we smelt the bar and make it into a shield over here. The workbench is too complicated. Wait, have I not done the quest? Hold, hold up, hold up. I have done the quest. What, why is it too complicated? I've done this before. Fuck. Okay, that, that book I dropped, I need to keep it in my inventory. Right, we're learning things. And flawlessly and very quickly, we can make our shield. Okay, now we can go actually do the things. Uh, despite having a mounted dig site pendant, I'm gonna go make a dig site pendant? Oh no, someone sold to this guy? Oh my god, everything's just difficult at the moment. Don't have sold on every world. Don't have- oh no. Come on, I just need a ruby, please. And add uh, this one's sold out. What's going on? Okay, yeah, we, we do the thing where you hop to a high-risk world because those ones have a confirmation message. Uh, high-risk world. Yeah. And here it is. Guaranteed one stock of ruby. Oh my god. Maybe my newly unlocked 1750 worlds. Maybe they're gonna be like really kind to me and have oh stock of rubies, but not heaps. Oh, beautiful 1750 total going hard. This is something I do on the account a lot. I just come up these stairs here and we grab a pickaxe. Very easy to get and it's right next to Lumbridge Telly. And then if I've got a gem in my inventory, I use that one. But if I don't have a gem in my inventory, I hit up this gem trader on the way past, and he often has emerald and sapphire ready to go, look at that. And then past there, I stop at Ale Morrisain and get the cosmic rune I need to enchant said piece of jewellery. And we head down to the crafting shop, because at the crafting shop we've got our mould and we're making a necklace. And we walk up to the mine, which has got the gold rocks, and we mine our gold. Anytime you see me with a piece of jewellery in my inventory, this is the process I've gone through to get it. Pretty much the same every time. So I showed you the process, but let's see why. Why am I making one of these when I've got one mounted in my house? This thing here would do me good. But what you might notice is that if I use my dig site pendant, there's no teleport options. Look at my true tile going. Yeah, I haven't unlocked the other ones, so we're going to go use this on some strange machinery. Just like this. Nothing interesting happens. That's what I do. Oh, maybe it's this thing. Oh, this one has the picture. Oh, they're both strange machines. All right, so now we can teleport to here, and that's much nicer for getting to various things. Okay, note to self, for this task, bring more than one food. Okay, okay, we have to teleport out with two wyverns left. Oh, that's uh, awkward. Oh my god, it dropped lobsters. Are we insane? Can we stay? Back-to-back -back lobsters? Not back-to-back -back lobsters, but I'm not trying one with 11. <laughs> oh, tallying out with one left on task. That's so gross. I think we're just going to use the bones natty on the altar because we don't have marin tools anywhere. Give us a little bit of extra XP. That's kind of nice. Cleaned our very first fossil. Let's go put it somewhere. Oh, oh, hold. It's not our very first fossil. We've done one before. So you saw the prayer drops from those wyverns and like their regular loot? R really good. Wyverns are great. And when we get a task we really like, we go do a Turiel task in between, which will allow us to have a chance at rolling that one back to back. On this account, because everything's so slow, doing shit like this is extra important. So do we do something fun in the meantime? 50. Kelfite? No, not in the slightest. We have a medium clue coming in. I also have a whole bunch of, like, easy clues, but just ignore them for now. They're for later. Wow, holy Alex. 
check out this safe spot. I've got this one corner trapped across here and it's trapping this one across this line and then this one stuck behind the other two. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh shit, that's an expensive hard clue, but I think I can do that. 84,000 for the rune plate body and 83k for the rune helmet. Holy shit. Whew. Ha, get shit on double agent. Helmet OP. We're gonna need a seriously valuable drop to recover from this step though, I think. We need about 100k in Elks to break even from that. And the verdict is... Cloggers! That does not look like enough Elks though. Oh, we got the Black Demons. That's the other one I kind of wanted to block, but you need 250 quest points and we have only 228. So let's just go just like bang out some of the easy quests, see if we can just get that and block these for now. Just a minor amount of arson, just gonna, you know, burn this guy's house down. No shit, he put it out. Corsair cursed him. And Witch's Potion, finishing off all the free-to-play quests. There is the mightily frustrating Big Ass Dwarf completed. As our secret behind the scenes easy clues go on, that's 71 thieving, which means we can do the next thing of Pyramid Plunder, which we'll definitely do sometime. Another slice of ham, which gives us 73 prayer. What a good number, and one more to unlock something spicy. Oh, these door cutscenes are quite long and I left some stuff back in the first room that I really need to pick up. Otherwise, I'm going to need to do another trip. Ah, inventory management on this quest was much harder than I'd been expecting. Go, go, no run energy. Go. Come on. Come on. Surely the stuff's still there? Surely the stuff's still there? Uh, shit. Well... Guess we do another trip. <laughs> okay, we dropped a pickaxe and the first four tiers of logs. So let's go get all those pickaxe first. <laughs> all right, take two. We've got all our stuff. Why am I building a wall? I kind of wanted to go through there. Oh, maybe I should have read quest dialogue. I might have explained that. Ah, oh, and he just fucked up my wall. That's rude. Oh, God damn, his skeleton friend fucked up my wall. All right, after much confusion about Skellingtons, there's, there's um, the Unix Lamington. Some really nice birdhouse run gains. There's the Loverkinge quest, which no longer requires sulfur mining to unlock it. Hell yes. Oh, look at the snoz on that thing. Holy. Well, we got a head. Huh. You can't step under this guy. I wanted to do, like, step under flinches, because crossbow's slow, but... Apparently not. He doesn't fucking hit anything though. What? I like brought stuff and prepared and he's just like, nah, big zero. Big zero. Oh, look at that. Double zero. Big zero. Holy boss. Oh my god. Prayer off. You're insane. Oh, okay. Maybe he does do some damage. Oh no, am I gonna have to use a dose of... No, I don't have to use a dose of prayer. That was, um, difficult. What do I need? Gold. Oh my god, that's an- Holy shit. The oh, I can't drop it again. That thing was huge. I wonder if when we shrink this beanstalk, it shrinks any more giants up there. Now there's just like tiny giants. Like we had the giant dwarf and now we've got the tiny giant. Oh, cool. Whoa, that had some XP drops. Nice. Grim Tail's done. Wait, where's the- Where's- <laughs> Where's the people? Oh, found one. Oh, that wasn't mage gear on. Oh, we hit anyway. Okay, that was fun. Okay, that last one, I'm not going to open up the chat, but if I go to game, yeah, look at that, we've got points so I can get something super important. I think that this is the first item that we're going to keep permanently on the account. Unless I've missed something, we will never get rid of this, and that's the first time I've had something like that, and that's so cool. This probably came out of the blue because I've shown zero clips of LMS, but uh, I like to focus while I'm doing it. That's beautiful, we've just got two more inventory spots. Sometime soonish, TM, we'll go back to TOA again. This time not with a bone crossbow, and re-upgrade it. But for now, that's just going to be wonderful for our questing. Oh, look at me go. Those guys in the back are going to spill so much beer. Look at that, that's going to be all over the floor. This, this guy's okay, but these ones, ugh, oh, those floors are going to be so sticky. 
This quest actually has a really cool end though, with like, the, the player knows, but your character has forgotten. I kind of like that disconnect, that's really cool. But not in a way that your character didn't see it, you were there, but you just forgot. Look at my fancy boots sticking up in the air. Gettable tail done, that puts us 10 quit. Hold on, that gave us two quest points, did it? Weird, okay. Nine quests off our goal. Queen of brutal murders completed. Go Luna Staff Bash. Bonk. Yeah, bonk. You know, if it's your first time doing a Kingdom Divided, pay attention to the story. The story's really interesting. There's cool characters, there's murder, there's deception, there's twists, and the boss fights for low to mid level are pretty good. However, if it's not your first time doing it like this, that's almost an hour of space barring and walking and oh my god that can be a drag. This would really benefit from some of that dialogue being optional and more action and less uh, talk to this person in this area, talk to this person in that area. First time five stars, this time one star. Ooh. But I do enjoy what we got from it though, let's put that on. We get... Oh, look at this XP, <laughs> holy, 67 Herblore, can clean Lantodimes, nice, and another 10,000. Mm. Oh, for requires no equipped items, well, I guess we're doing this one with no food then. Taking a wee bit of dam, but we chillin', all good. The land of the gobbies. Oh, fishing level, wasn't expecting that one. Oh, watch me go. Monkey's friend. Mountain daughter putting us at 249 quest points. Le poisson of interest. And seeing as we're here at Spreer, tasks block the black demons until we have lots of crafting to make Zenites. Well, it's better than black. Uh, nah, 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 let's just, we've just cancel all the tasks, rip all the points I got. But it means I get to, ah, oh, that one's chill, we can do that. This worm. Brings us to the end of an inventory, and 68 Slayer. It's going to be my first time making one of these potions, but exactly the same as we do the Ranars for XP, we can turn our Aventos into fishing potions. Thanks to a handy marital farming contract from Guildmaster Jane, we can light the burners for these couple of worm bones. Oh hell yes. One of us. One of us. <laughs> oh. God damn. 85 range. Whew, it's a big level. Oh, I can get my T-bone out. Let me just pop over to chambers real quick. Show me the bow. Ah, oh, 183 blue dragons. Oh my god, that's a long task. Holy shit. I, um, I'm gonna be withered and old by the time I manage to get done with this one. Happy 2074. I just spent the last 50 years doing that blue dragons task, and we used every dragon bone except for like three that I buried to make this inventory line up. Oh, actually, you can see the number in the chat four that I buried to make this number line up. And we've reanimated every single unsold head, and all the steel and mithril drops have gone to the giant's foundry, so it was slow as fuck, but that was really good. Hopefully, this next task will be the final one. Eh, it sucks, but we don't need that much XP. We'll do the greater demons. This is the dude. 69 Slayer. <sighs> ah! Yeah, that's the level we need for Quest Cape. That is all the Slayer we will need for this phase of the account. And I could not be happier. There's also two out of three goals from this video completed. We have one more to do, so let's go clear up our inventory for that. And as is tradition, we accidentally turned the first one into a poison current one. Mmm, delicious. 65? Skip a few. Oh, it's heavenly looking. It's 70 cooking. <laughs> ah, I've been planning that for so long. <laughs> okay, sick, that, that's the things done. Cheers for joining me on all this skilling and questing today. Hasn't it been lovely spending time together? Yeah, yeah, I thought so too. 
If you enjoyed, a subscription would be much appreciated. And you could also jump down into the description and check out my band, because we make some cool music that I would love to share with more people. Until next time, uh, cheerio!